Okay, y'all, so I'm about to make some oxtails, okay? And these are the seasonings that I use. I need to go to the store. Get some real onions, but I got from work and I just don't have time. Um, I did use a little jerk seasoning. I never had oxtail jerk seasoning, but hey, we gonna do it this time, okay? Um, and I did use two of the crushed red peppers since I have no onions. But anyway, yeah, so I'm about to let this marinate and then I'm gonna put it on the stove. Um, and then I'm putting in a crock pot, okay? But I'm about to let this marinate for a while, some hours, and then I'll come back and show y'all the recipe. Okay? okay, so I'm about to take these oxtails, fry in this pan, like, I'm sorry, not like fry, but um, sear in this pan. And then once I do that, I'm gonna put in this crock pot, okay? And I'm gonna pour this beef uh, broth in there. So, Let's put this. Yeah, I love this new stove. I love it. Okay. I didn't want to cook on. I did some baking. So I got to wash that. I have to, I'm cleaning the whole house up anyway. So I'm going to clean this after I do this part. All right. So, yeah. Let's put. I probably should put a little olive oil in here, but it's fine. You got enough juices in there. Stand up, child. Stand up. Stand up, child. Stand up, okay. I do. I do a package of oxtail out, oxtail out, because that's you know it looked old to me. So even though I kept it in the freezer all this time, I was not gonna eat that because yeah, it wasn't pink the way it should look. I was like, I'm not eating that. Are you crazy? So yeah, let's get this all you know um, seared, and then we'll be back. All right. All right. And then let me sear, as you can see. Okay, so now, let's take all these out. Put over here in the crock pot. There we go. Come on, Big Bertha. Big Bertha. Come on, Big old Bertha. Okay. And we're gonna just let these cook for like eight hours. Stop popping me. <clears throat> but yeah, that's second I feel she was not gonna cook that. It just did not look right to me. So we're gonna take our beef broth and put it in there like so. And you know what? I'm just gonna eat this over some brown rice. Ain't no for me saving put a little here. Like, no, I'm gonna just use all that and throw it out. Okay, so <clears throat> that's where we at right now. That seasoning gonna be choking coffee. Okay, I have a mess over here because I'm cleaning the kitchen up, but don't worry, all is gonna be so it has a restock my bins. I'm going to the grocery store today to fill all these containers up. I need to restock over there too. You see that? So yeah. So right here, cook for eight hours, and I'm gonna show y'all what it look like when it's done. All okay, right. Y'all remember the oxtail I was cooking? Okay, look at this. Look, fall right off the bone. Look at that. They done. See? Fall right off the bone. Hold on. Let me show you again. Hold on. Look at this. Look at that. Fall right off the bone. So they done. I just put some brown rice on, so I'm cooking that, and then, yeah, if you have, I plate it up and show y'all what it looks like, okay? All right, y'all, here they go, the oxtail. They are done. I got some brown rice. I should, you know what? I should make some veggies. I had some mixed veggies, and I could have ate. Yep, this is like one pack of oxtail, and I cooked these in a crock pot, so, yeah. And now, I put some lettuce juices after... Add the crop out the juices on the rice, some brown rice. Oxtail. Look, it looks so good too. And you know what? It falls right off the bone. Let me show y'all. Look at this. Look at that. Yes. Okay, so I'm not gonna have dinner now. This is my dinner for tonight. And I gotta figure out what I'm gonna eat tomorrow because baby, that one pack I was still gonna be gone. Look, I do the other one away, so. 
Yeah. Anyway, let's uh, let's get it in.